It's the eve of semifinal Saturday in high school football state playoffs. Morton, Tri-Valley, and Ridgeview Lexington all just one victory away from the state finals. In Class 5A, Morton has embraced its role as an underdog this postseason. Now the Potters have perhaps their biggest challenge yet on the road against number one seed Kankakee. It's a test for Morton and they're up for it. They can't wait for the opportunity. They're a very good football team, very athletic football team, big, fast, physical, you know, everybody's really good at this point. Um, they got to play us as well. Uh, so we, we just have to play really good discipline football and, uh, you know, continue to find ways to run the football and, and control the game from that standpoint. Morton at Kankakee Saturday afternoon, kickoff at 3 o'clock. The last two state championships from Class 2A came from the Heart of Illinois Conference. Tri-Valley hopes to make that three in a row this season. The Vikings travel to Wilmington tomorrow in a battle of two 12-0 teams and the top seeds in their respective brackets. Tri-Valley feels well prepared for the showdown. I think our conference does well in, in, in getting us ready for this time of year and and uh, you know hopefully it prepares us for Wilmington this week. We've got to establish the line of scrimmage and we got to be just as physical as them if not more physical. Tri-Valley at Wilmington a five o'clock kickoff Saturday night. Ridgeview Lexington is representing the HOI conference in the class 1A semifinals. The Mustangs upset top ranked A-Town last week and now just one went away from a trip to a state title match and just the program's first year as a co-op football program. All that stands in their way is perennial power, Lena Winslow. I'm sure the first thing that our opponents are seeing that we've got four losses and um, and we're a 13 seed. So, you know, um, I hope that Lena feels the same way and that we're not very good and, um, you know, we can surprise them as well. The Mustangs play at two Saturday afternoon. Highlights from all three of those semifinal games coming up on WMED Weekend Edition.